Hello, I'm Marcia Berry from Berry Nutritional Coaching. You know, when I work with clients and people who come to my lectures, I find that people are pretty savvy about nutrition and food these days. They understand a lot from reading and from television, but I discover also over and over that there are about seven mistakes people make. And I want to share with you today one of those mistakes so that you don't make the same mistake. And that is going to diet soda. You know, a lot of people struggle with their weight these days. We have a 66% incidence of overweight and obesity in our country. And so people logically believe, well, if I get the high fructose corn syrup or the sugar out of my soda, I'm doing myself a favor. Unfortunately, the studies show just the opposite. One study from the University of Texas Health Center studied the people who drank one serving one can or bottle of diet soda a day versus those who didn't and found that they had a 41 percent greater chance of being overweight. Another study followed drinkers of diet soda over the course of 10 years and they found that those who drank two or more diet sodas a day increased their waist size five times more than people who didn't drink diet soda. When I explain this to my clients, they often say, well, am I better off going back to full sugar soda? Unfortunately, it doesn't work that way. All soda, whether it's diet soda or the regular full calorie soda, acidifies our tissues. It leaches minerals from our bones and our teeth. It undermines our immune system. And it packs on the pounds, even the diet soda. A better choice would be something like tea. I mean, you have many choices out there, but one that I like is tea. Whether it's green tea, bancha twig tea, African red bush tea, or an herbal tea like chamomile tea. Each one has something different to offer in the way of antioxidants, and none of them add calories. Cheers.